Hi, okay, this is just a quick video to show you how to find a different domain name and a domain name alternative if you want to go after a particular keyword or niche and can't find a suitable domain for some reason. Generally, if you're targeting, targeting a niche, there will always be uh, a good keyword-based domain name to go for, but if it's just a specific keyword that you're targeting for some reason, then sometimes there may not be. And here's an example. I'm looking at some of my starred keywords, and we've got a couple here, wedding suits and wedding suit, which is a high value keyword uh, with not an awful lot of competition going on here. Not very many backlinks, not a lot of page rank, uh, and there's definitely some opportunities here to go for, or at least one. Um, okay, so what I'm actually gonna do is show you a different way of finding a domain name that includes the keyword dem uh, wedding suits, okay? Because at the moment, there are none showing as .com, .net, .org, either for wedding suits or wedding suit. So what we're going to do is I will leave this list under this video. This is a list of alternative keyword uh, suffixes and prefixes. And what we're going to do is just highlight the tag keyword part, copy that, go to edit and replace. And we're going to pop that into find what, and then we're going to put the wedding suit Oh, not sweet, wedding suit keyword with no space into the replace with. We click on replace all and hey presto, we now have a whole bunch of potential domain names that we can search for. So first wedding suit, about wedding suit, discover wedding suit, easy wedding suit, I wedding suit, learn about wedding suit, wedding suit blog, daily, diary, direct, discuss. You can see there's all sorts of options available here. Um, as I said, you shouldn't really need to do this very often because the part of the point of Niche Reaper is to find these keyword targeted domains for you. But if there's one you want to go for that, or a keyword that you want to go for that doesn't have something suitable available, this is how you can do it. This is a good list of alternative keyword based domain names. Now next, we're gonna show you exactly how you can find which of these is available because you don't want to do that manually. Okay, so what we need is a bit of software that is free. It's from a site called Domain Punch. If I pull this down a bit, you can see the domain name in the URL, domainpunch.com front slash products front slash DNA for domain name analyzer. And this is a free piece of software. So you can just click on the download now free and it will take you down to the download page. Click on download and that will download. Install it and this is what you'll have. Uh, it's really quite a cool piece of software. Um, what we need to do, first of all, if you go to click on add domains to start off with, it will give you a warning and say we need to set up a database. So the first thing you do is click on new, give the database a name. Uh, let's just call it domain searches, that'll do. Okay, and we can then add our new domains that we want to search for. So I'm gonna grab all of these and I'm gonna pop them in there. Okay, now here's the useful part. We can then tick on .com, .net, .org, and any other variations you want as well. So if you wanted to check for the .co.uk, you could. Click on OK, and it's gonna import all those. Let's squidge this bit down a bit. And all we need to do is highlight the whole lot, and click on search or check all, which is this. And it will go away and queue them up and actually have a look to see which of those are available. Now I'm gonna pause the video while it actually runs through those. Okay, let's finish searching. Let's actually move this around and make it a bit bigger so we can see what's going on a bit more. Okay, basically that's finished searching through those. Most of these are available. Um, if we scroll down, there's bound to be some taken somewhere. Yeah, there you go. There's one that re requires renewal. Okay, but uh, that's uh, how quick and easy it can be to find some domain names that are available that still include your keyword. Now I'd recommend the ones that have the keyword at the start rather than at the end. So wedding suit reviews is gonna be better than understanding wedding suit and the shorter the better as well. Um, although wedding suit reviews is a good one because it's got the word review in there. Uh, what else we got if we scroll up? Wedding suit tips. That was there somewhere, where's it gone? There you go. So WeddingSuitTips.com is available. That might be a very good choice. So you can see how using this simple bit of software and the simple domain variations with those tags in, you can quickly find some alternative domains if you want to still target an exact keyword and there isn't the exact match available for you. Okay, I'll put a link for this domain name analyzer software 
under this video as well so you can grab a copy of that as I said it's free I think there may be a paid version as well but the, it, this standard version is free and you can use it as, you, as you've seen very quickly and easily hope you found this video useful and please feel free to move on to the next training video thanks very much